God bless you guys. This is Sean here from Faith Bring Change. I hope you're enjoying your uh, Saturday today. Uh, very interesting. I put out a video just a second ago, you know, about Jesus came, uh, you know, he's coming for a church without spot, wrinkle, or blemish. And this is, guys, why I preach like this. A person posted something. They're supposed to be a Christian. said, there's only one kingdom uh, of God. It's a kingdom of reconciliation between Jesus between the kingdom, between God, the Father, I'm paraphrasing, and the fallen angels. The gospel of reconciliation is to bring fallen angels into the kingdom of God. They said, we are angels, uh, we are fallen angels, something about the DNA and, and, and darkness to be reconciled back to Jesus Christ. All other gospels are false and all this stuff, and I, I even clicked on them, and they were legitimate they have tons of messages they do to other churches and guys and so this is a demon being brought out these demons are afraid of this gospel of jesus coming back for a church without spot wrinkle or blemish because when you preach i told you guys the undiluted word of god it's powerful guys demons tremble at it so i'm i'll see if it'll let me uh post this picture this link of this into the description box uh but but this is why, guys, I preach like this. And I had a dream. I woke up. I saw this after waking up. Dreamt I was like, Lord had me lifted up off the ground. And I had one of those sackcloth robes on. And it's funny because there's a Jonah cartoon where I always thought it was a little funny when he was going into Nineveh. It was kind of exaggerated. He gave this kind of death stare, his Jonah stare. And he had like fiery eyes and something about the conviction, just conviction, people to repent. And I guess the Lord was echoing that to be funny. But it's like I had that. Jonah's that death stare lock on them kind of like it and it's funny because God does this stuff and it's like they were convicted or they they repented or whatever and I just I think he maybe seen that comment that that person did and it, it really bothered them uh and so he posted that but that was demons speaking through people guys and so this gospel of reconciliation the way they're preaching it guys reconciliation you can go and sin and do all this stuff that just proved guys what I was saying that those are demons basically speaking through people it's not the true gospel it's lies guys jesus is coming back for a church without spot wrinkle or blemish and if you preach and go and sin and sometimes you're no threat to the demons guys but when you preach coming uh get in a church without spot wrinkle or blemish you're gonna make a lot of demons nervous guys because they said we they didn't say i we are the fallen angels and so i'll go ahead and see if they'll let me post what they said but uh yeah, take a look for it if I can get it myself. It's very interesting. Go back and look at my previous video. All right, guys. Love you. Till next time. Shalom.